Folks, it's a tremendous privilege to have Dave Conroy here. This year's keynote speaker. It's very pleased to see so many of you here. You've done, you've done the right thing to come and see him, rather than whatever the film is that he's up against. I purposely made it what I thought was our weakest film. So that, <laughs> uh, so that we had your, the maximum attendance here. I've, I've only known Dave about 18 months, two years, something like that. I, I, and I probably only really encountered him through, as a result of this festival existing, and, and sort of moving uh, away from my motorcycle background into the broader adventure community, uh, in which Dave is a giant, white-hot slab of unstoppable energy and dynamism. Um, the irony is, is that as far as I can tell, Dave doesn't seem to have anything at all that corresponds to a full-time job. Um, he spends his entire time doing incredible things, I, I'm quietly confident that he's skinned, and I mean that as a, co as a, as a compliment. Massively. Massively yeah. skinned. Um, this is like, very healthy, I think. Uh, keeps you on your toes. Uh, keeps you, as you see, he's got no shoes. <laughs> <laughs> and for that reason, he is very much known as the Jesus. Of, uh, <laughs> I know, that doesn't mean that you, madam, are Mary Mad business. Don't worry about that. Uh, what they said about that. How does anybody know what we should, what should we be doing? So, um... <laughs> Uh, so it's really, it's a really big deal to have him here. I was absolutely uh, uh, confident when I was in Los Angeles and I, and I booked him. I was certain that he just wouldn't do it because we're not a big enough star in the, in the solar system of adventure for him to attend. Um, and so I was firstly really grateful that he, uh, he agreed to come. Uh, and then the other thing is that Dave is a full-time, uh, amongst other things, professional motivational speaker. And rightly so, because he's totally motivational. Uh, and his presentation is legendary, as is he. So I thought, well, I was talking to Lois, I said, well, how much can we uh, uh, afford? And we did our sums, and it wasn't very much. And once again, like with Ben Fogel, if they've charged us what he's worth, and, done, and I'm not going to suggest how much he gets paid, but I certainly would imagine if I was your agent, I'd be putting you out for £5,000 an hour, easily. You're higher. That's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean, I've been to those corporate training days, and you get like some real rubbish from these agencies and stuff. You know, I, I don't know how many times I want to watch a story about somebody who's climbed Everest to Everest. I mean, uh, so Dave is a, well, I'm serious, at least five thousand uh, pounds uh, a time, and he hasn't charged us that much. Because if he had, of course, he'd be at home now yeah. <laughs> <laughs> with his pot noodle and uh, and all those. Block channels where they are, and um, <laughs> so it's a huge. The good thing is, is that Dave is uh, in the world of adventure. He's a polymath. He's not just somebody who climbed a mountain in a, in a certain year and is just telling that story again and again and again. He's permanently on the go. This, the, the, oh, the, what seemed to be the startup photo before is him in all of these different guises of all these different things that he's done. He is, a tr I mean, a truly exceptional human being. And, and, and he almost didn't get booked because he's too amazing. We like, I'm serious, we like, we like to book people who are kind of like, who could be the guy next door type thing, who, who it turns out have sailed around the world. But Dave is such an unusually energetic and charismatic person, he could have been a success in anything that he, that he put his hand to, and he would have been. He chose adventure, and so we're lucky enough to have him today. Ladies and gentlemen, and this is not me being sick about it, you should see me on full overdrive. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Dave Gondway. <laughs> Is it possible to do them? No. Oh. Everyone can see the screen? Yeah. yeah.